It's time once again for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. Meow! Meow! Hello everybody, it's Uncle Matt and I'm here to read you another bedtime story. And tonight's bedtime story has to deal with a pretty cool adventure. Now, I haven't even been on this adventure, but this city cat has, this city cat has traveled around Europe. And it uh, looks like here are some of the destinations that the city cat traveled. UK, Germany, Italy, France, Spain. Pretty lucky. Well, are you ready? Should we get into the story? City Cat by Kate Banks and uh, illustrated by Lauren Castillo. And this story is copyright in 2013. Are you ready? Here we go. City Cat. Wake up, city cat. It's dawn. Watch the day put clothing on in the city colors, brown, black, rust, and gray. City cat heads for the street, sprinting, striding, city cat. City cat scales ragged walls. She romps through ruins set in stone, then tiptoes through a sacred space and cuddles in a hidden place where she won't be found. Wheels a-whirling, cat a-purring, daring, wayfaring city cat, where are you going, city cat? Dancing, prancing city cat, waltzing past a French cafe. She bathes herself around a midday underneath a fountain spray. City cat, lured by smells of fresh caught fish, lurks around the city port. She sits on piers with perked up ears and gazes out to sea. The waves they tumble, rise and rumble, beckoning city cat. Floating, boating city cat, where are you drifting, city cat? City cat, Slinks through market stalls where vendors sell their wares. She pounces, prances, rolls around, and disappears without a sound. Oh, city cat, nimble, agile city cat, arched like an arrow's willful bow. She leaps from rooftops overhead and makes a bed in terrace pots or naps in city parking lots. Humming drumming city cat shh don't wake the city cat city cat strutting down the boulevards taking in the city sights the skyline pulsing bathed in light an obelisk a graceful arch a gilded bridge a sprawling park She folds her paws and drops her head and settles on a gargoyle's bed until awakened by a gentle rain, she heeds the call of the midnight train. Globe-trotting train-spotting city cat, where are you going, city cat? City Cat is on the run from the morning mist and the baffled sun hidden by the fog. She squints into a smoky sky and sees a tower rising high. City Cat stalks city birds, snaring, snarling, scratching City Cat, green eyes slanting, sitting proud. She joins the starlings evening dance. Then in a trance, she watches the changing of the guard. Windward, wayward, city cat. Where are you going, city cat?
swaying playing city cat, mimics the tall ship's blowing masks. Dazzled by a riverboat, she stops to groom her satin coat, then hops on board and floats further out to sea. Rollicking, frolicking city cat tweaks her nose and wets her feet. She searches for a bite to eat, then curls among the evening post, happy to have found a host. Hustling, bustling city cat, where are you going, city cat? Oh, city cat, gallivanting city cat, circles under angels wings and listening to the city sing its spinning wheels and merry crowds city cat waving her tail like a magic wand hears a clock chime overhead and stops to watch a couple wed city cat where are you going city cat City Cat marches through the narrow streets, um, trots across the Bridge of Sighs, then taunts the pigeons in the square, wishing for a mask to wear. Masquerading City Cat, ser serenading birds and bats, making mischief, chasing rats, bold and brazen City Cat. Careful now, don't make a sound. City cat is homeward bound, wedged between two leather bags stamped with stickers of country flags. She licks her fur and takes a nap on a well-worn city map, and she wakes, she's home again. Tonight, She'll sleep far from harm, curled up in a statue's arm, and dream of blinking city lights, city travelers, and city nights. Not far away, tucked in bed, a little boy will turn his head and dream of blinking city lights, city cats, and city nights. Here are some locations, I'll try to zoom in a bit, where city cat visited. the end. Well, that's all the time we have for Uncle Matt's bedtime story. I hope you enjoyed that story, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.